today we're at the range and we'll be shooting a bowling ball. Here's the bowling ball. Just regular old bowling ball with a couple different rounds. Starting from the left is a 17 HMR, a 9 millimeter, a 40, a 357 mag, a 556 green tip, a 762 AK round, and at the right is a 458 lot. So stay tuned and we'll take a shot, or a couple shots at least, to see what happens to a bowling ball. So that was the 17. We got a good hit, but all it did was crack the outer surface of it. It's right in there. So let's roll her over to a new site. Let's hit it with a 9mm. Let's go see what it did. Gun clear. So that was the nine millimeter. So that was the nine millimeter and it did a fairly good number on it. So we're going to go back to the drawing board, spin her around, and fire a 40 at it. So this is the 40 at a bowling ball. Wow. So this was the 40 at the bowling ball. It actually did a fairly good number. Here's some pieces of it down here. I didn't think that layer of plastic or whatever it is would be that thick. I mean, look how thick that is. You know, some thick stuff. Is that like concrete under it? I think that's concrete or rock or something. But yeah, it did a number on it. You think we can have another shot at it? Maybe another round at it? Or... It's good. <laughs> I mean, it cracked it good. Let's see. Let's shoot at the same spot where the 17 was. So, we spun it around, we're gonna take another shot at it, okay? So, 357. SP 101. Brand new toy for him. Let's see what it does to a bowling ball. So that's the new hole. We think he grazed it, so we're gonna put it back up there and let him go again. So 357, take two. And that's a miss. Also miss. Do we need to switch? <laughs> <laughs> no 
There's one left. So, we got the second hit from the 357, and that's a weird little pattern. It's like soaking out right there at the top. That's weird. So, here we go. We got another clean shot. We can do a, what's next, a 556 five, green tip? So, 556 five, green tip. So, we got a little crack there, out of the green tip. Huh. Well, time for the AK round. So this is where it stopped at, real close to where I keep my other camera, on the wood. So I think it's, you see any new stuff? Unless it's that right there. Which means it just grazed it. Probably it, right? Probably. So, we think that's it. So, next is going to be the 458 lot on a brand new bowling ball. Okay, that's the new bowling ball that we have set aside for the 458 lot. So, let's see how it holds up to it. So, 
hope I don't miss. Walking up on it. Looks a little flat on the bottom. So there's pieces up there. That's where it was sitting. Oh, here's a big piece right there too. And let's see. That's what a elephant round does to a bowling ball. It's made a little different. Hmm. So, if you ever want to know what a 458 lot does to a bowling ball, well, that's it. So, now that you know what the 458 does to a bowling ball, if you have any suggestions on what I should shoot next with the 458, just leave a comment below. Please give me a like, and here's that round again, which is one big round. Here's the two bowling balls. If you have any comments or any suggestions on what should be shot next, just comment below. Thank you. Goodbye.